Hey guys, Jody Pop. Time to do a movie review for Inside Out. But I don't really want to do it. What if you don't like it? But like, whatever if you don't. So Inside Out, I just showed the five major emotions highlighted in that movie. We have joy. We have sadness. We have fear. We have disgust. And we have anger. So, in the movie, Joy and Sadness go on an adventure into Riley's imagination. The movie is basically about Riley, a little 12-year-old girl who has moved all the way to California, where they have weird things like broccoli pizza. Um, I'm from California. I've never had a broccoli pizza, but I have had a tofu pizza. So, she's going through all these emotions. She's moved. And now things are acting a little, little wonky upstairs. So joy and sadness go on this adventure inside the mind of Riley. It really reminds me of this generation's Brave Little Toaster. It had the same heart and it had that same feeling of growth. Don't want to spoil too much. So is this appropriate for younger kids? It does have a lot of slapstick moments, which I think will hold the younger kids at the very beginning. The ending does get a little deep. It gets emotional. It's like an emotional roller coaster. Sorry, I will stop. <laughs> but it gets a little deep. Kids, younger kids will not really understand the end of the movie. But if you're like eight years old, I do think this movie would hold your interest. And it would be a movie that would grow with you as you got older and you'd be able to see it in different ways. So we all know Pixar makes amazing movies and this is no exception. This is like probably one of my top movies of Pixar. Uh, Wall-E is an amazing movie. It's probably their best movie. Cars, though, is a much more watchable movie. I've seen Cars like 20 bazillion times because I have 20 bazillion cousins. This movie really skates that line between the series of Wall-E and the funness of Cars. Finding Nemo does that really well, which is Finding Nemo. is one of my other top uh, Pixar movies. Bonus highlights. The score. This is probably one of the best scores I've heard in a very, very, very long time. Another highlight, there's a Chinatown joke. Amazing. It had a lot of fun little links like that for the adults, which Pixar is really good at. Overall, I thought this movie was really good. It made me all joyful and happy. So you should see it um, if you haven't already seen it. So I'm Jenny Pop. Uh, Inside Out was awesome. Again, it skates that really thin line between too serious Wally and too fun cars. It makes it really enjoyable for both adults and children. So, yeah, follow me on Twitter, uh, Jenny Pop, SoCal Jenny Pop. Also, subscribe. Hit a button. You should do it. Do it. Later, guys.